What up, players? What about stay up in this? Mmm, me. And, um, thank you for all of the supportive, kind, encouraging compliments and uh, comments all of you have been leaving. I really appreciate it. I've, uh, don't worry, I've been just lying in bed and being very unproductive and just taking care of myself all day, but I thought that at some point I should get up and put some work into my models. So, um, I'm gonna take it, really take it easy today and just do some minor detailing work, like I said, clean up the blacks around the masks and the bodysuits, and um, we'll see if I even get onto any more highlighting of the skin or or painting up the um, the highlights for the armor. We'll see. Uh, I'm, I'm just gonna take it easy. I've got my hot cup of <clears throat> tea here next to me. I've just took my delicious delicious NyQuil. I, I might not go the whole three hours because I'm seriously not feeling very well but um, I'll go as long as I can and we'll see what I get done. So don't worry about me, I'll get better and um, in the meantime thank you for watching, thanks for supporting my channel and oh I want to show you something while you look at my dark Eldar. Um, I actually took this picture on my camera phone the other day and I've been meaning to show it to you all but um, I've just been so so busy at work. <clears throat> my channel at one point, I don't remember when, has reached elite status. Isn't that cool? <laughs> I don't know why I thought that was so funny. I, I saw it when I was at work and I was like, I'm not going to be home for a couple hours. What if I get more subscribers between now and then? So I just took a picture of it off my work, um, off my laptop at work. And yeah, I wanted to show it to you. So super stoked. I thought that was awesome. And um, now we're going to get back to work. On painting these dark Eldar so I'll see you at the end of this video all right so we're back it's a couple of hours later and um, I was actually able to get a lot of rest and um, taking some medicine and feel a lot better so uh, I got was able to get three dark Eldar which is that I actually finished um, started taking them through and as I was painting I was like you know I'm just gonna get through these and see how long it takes just to see at, at this point how fast I can build up the steps and um, I'm pretty happy with it so let me take you through the three that I finished here's the first one what I noticed was that I wanted to paint all of the spiky bits on their bodysuits and on their leggings in gold and so it was a task for me to to um, paint them in the brown and then the gold uh, right after and and then I have to go back and clean them up a little bit so uh, so here's yeah here's my first guy I decided to start painting the tattoos at the end of doing the skin so this guy's got a tattoo slash right above his left eye um, and also some of them have have flesh like wraps around their around their waists and some of them have this warlock purple cloth colored wrap so this girl's got a warlock purple cloth um, this fella here has a flesh wrap flayed skin I guess you would call it um, I didn't decide not to give him a tattoo because he's got this weird slash scar on his forehead Let's see a little better in this light I also decided to give them all just like the the games workshop have this black stripe in their hair um, Lela Tesprax has it so I decided to give these witches as well just to tie them into the games workshop style here's the third guy that I finished just now <clears throat> and uh, he's got a flayed skin wrap around his waist as well as well as these um, gold studs on his leggings now these guys they have uh, they're supposed to be I guess completely bald with uh, these scars on their heads but I decided to give them more like red corn roll kind of effect from across the field so it kind of looks like they have they have hair just like uh, 
comb back. Um, yeah, so let me know what you think. This is, like I said, day four, I think, in Project Dark Eldar. And the skin is turning out, um, I, I kind of like the skin, it's not exactly dark gray like the drow from Forgotten Realms, but it's not, um, it's definitely very sickly pale looking, and I attribute that to the, the mixture of the ogren flesh and the Asurman blue. So uh, I think it was a great idea to, to um, mix those washes that way, I think it turned out really nice, you could really see it, the effect that it has on the, on the arm there makes it look really sickly and uh, <clears throat> just not well, like me. So I'm going to get off and go back to sleep and I hope you enjoy this video and we'll see you in day 5 of Project Dark Eldar tomorrow. So take care, hopefully we'll get another 3 at least done and um, uh, keep on trucking. <laughs>